hello friends welcome back java t coding and today i will talk about how we can create the new repository on github account and how we can connect that repository using the eclipse or spring tool suit to the github account and how we can commit our changes or the project on github so we will talk in the, in this video all those things and if you have not subscribed my channel please subscribe and press the bell icon for more java related videos so let's get started so firstly go to the github.com and uh, here if you have account then click on the sign up if you don't have the account on the so then create a github account first i have made already video on it so please first watch how we can create an account on github and in this video we will focus on how we can create the new getter or username and just i'm entering my credential and click on sign up sign in and here you be you can see this is the github gui and there is an option to create a new git repository there is a first plus sign option also we can go with the new button so just click on plus and new repository and here you can need to give the repository my test repo and now here you can give the description as optional so you can give anything is a project or repository related and just select on readme option and these are also optional just click on create repository so yeah this repository my test repository has been created successfully and this is the and now we will connect that repository using the eclipse or spring tool suit so just click on uh, code option there is option and here you will get the url github url or repository url so just click on copy button and go to our stc or eclipse and here you can find just click on the plus option here is the get option is there so just click on click on it and here you can add an existing local repository clone git repository create a new local git repository so just uh, click on create a new git repository local and sorry click on clone repository and here this is the url and this is the git host and it automatically will take because we have copied and here you need to provide a username password if i have not provided it will ask again later just click on next and here is the master branch uh, okay next and this is the directory where it will uh, store our projects at the locally local path just click on the finish and here is the processing yeah so processing has been completed yes this is now we are able to connect our repository right so this is the my test repo it's created in a github as you can see this is my test repo and last push our code in this repository right so just create a, create a new project here and just create a new project and that project we need to push it just i am creating simple java project here is the test project simple and just click on next and finish and this java project has been created successfully and now we will share comment and post that project on github account so go to the teams there is the option team here is the team my pc is little bit slow here you can uh, you will get the answer is share project so just click on the share project 
and here you need to select the repository if you have not connected the repository you will not get this option so firstly you need to copy that url from github and just clone it in your uh, eclipse or a spring tool suit so after that you will get this option now this is the project and just click on the finish so as you can see this project is on my test repository but it's not we, we just if you refresh you will not get that project because we haven't commit or push till now just we have to sh connect that project to the my test repository so now again just click on right click and go to the again teams now you will get all those options so here you will get the commit option so just click on commit here here we need to provide here we need to select all those project related files just drag and drop in the stage to stage and here you need to provide uh, your username java t coding and here this is the first commit you need to provide the message and here is the option commit and push these are if you commit then you need to push again or directly you can commit and push at a time so just click on commit and push and it is asking username password show subtext or series at gmail.com and you need to provide a password and just log in yes this is the first commit the push result is successfully pushed on my test on the master branch my test repository just close and now if you refresh our repository on github you will get that project yes this is the test project just we have just we have come at one minute ago right so in this way we can push your project on github account let's add one more file if you are able to if you create or modify your existing project that is already co connected to github so let's uh, com dot test and here create test test class test only test public static void man and finish just we have created a new java file and here is created and here you can see the question mark sign because this is the new file that is not it not yet committed on the my test repository on the test project so let system dot dot out okay just simple committed first project okay so let's commit this class as well so as you can see here is a this this uh, test java file we will automatically populated it and stays so we need to drag and drop stays and here you need to provide a message and username first you need to provide the username and here you need to provide the message so that uh, we can understand the message what you have done the changes in this project particular so what we have did added new java file and now click on commit and push and you need to provide a username password sub tag dot series at gmail.com and here you need to provide your password and click on login and this changes will be post successfully on my master branch 
my test repository just close and go to a repository just refresh here you will get that just 30 uh, 37 seconds ago we have added one java class this is the test one right so this way so in this way we can create a new repository and we will connect we, we can connect that repository and after that whatever we we did the changes and we can commit and push on the github account if you and the, if you have scenario and if you have any concern or doubt please comment it out here i will try to answer that your questions and in then that's it from this video in the next video we will see how we can push and commit our changes using the github git base command line using the command line how we can push our code on github account so that's it from this video if you like this video please comment like and subscribe thanks for watching